What I have realized over the year working with different developer and looking at their resume, their portfolio, their GitHub profile, what I have found that they don't work on the GitHub profile. Yes, it's important. If you're a developer, you have to have an impressive portfolio on GitHub. You have to branch out. You have to highlight all the skills which you know. So that will play a very important role when you will sit for internship, when you will sit for a job interview. So these are the things will help the help the recruiter to understand about you. Okay, you have done something and you know all of this work and you have to highlight your skills in a beautiful way. So it can create a better impressive. So let me show you what I mean by that and how you can create your get up profile in an amazing way. You can highlight all the skills which you have developed and learned over the year and how you can highlight some of the important points about your work. So this is the my get up profile. You can see here I have highlighted about myself then I have given soft description about it. Then I have given my social media link and here I have highlighted all the languages, all the thing which I have worked on. Actually I know but only those projects I have highlighted those languages which I have highlighted, which I have built project on that. So you can see these are the skills which I have. Here you can able to find the graphs, the branch, that how many stars I have got and all of the things. So you should always have a portfolio on GetUp just like this where you are highlighting in a beautiful graphical way. And trust me, this will not take more than five minutes to create this amazing portfolio profile on GetUp. All you have to do is to provide some basic information. And this particular tool, which I'm going to show you, it will create the entire markup. All you have to do is to create a file and simply copy and paste. So right now, like this particular website was earlier, it was very popular. It was creating a basic design, which was not that impressive. So you can see if you provide all of the informations here, you can highlight your skills, you can highlight your skills, all the programming language like mobile development AI database and we have the data visualizations we have the dots we have the framework so you can simply select the language on the program so you know and it will create the readme file for you so you can see here I have already selected but this will create the basic one so if I come back here and if I try to click on this generate with me file what it's going to do is it's going to create a readme file for me okay you can see it will generate the entire markup but this one is a basic one you won't get a portfolio profile like this like with this star marks this with with this beautiful design you won't get that so for that i personally like to use this particular website which is really amazing and it's free to use all you have to do is to give the name of your of your github profile so i'll say dalat and you have to click on this then you have to simply copy paste the entire about you okay so if i come back here if i simply come back and i want to get all of this information about myself so let me quickly grab all of this simply copy let me get all of this or i can do one thing i can get the entire one so simply copy and that's all you have to do is you have to come here and you have to paste here select and simply paste it's going to have all of this information you can see now click on this next then you can select the styling that what kind of styling you want to have you want to have a border you want to have a lifetime counter or you have to have a private commit so make sure to just simply select all of this because you want to showcase your skills you want to highlight every single thing so once you do that it's going to pull out all the information about your getup repo and it's going to highlight here so click on this next and here you have to provide the social media icons and that will work fine if you provide that one is here you have to select all the languages programming language which you are learning so make sure to select one by one whatever you know about the tools click on the next and here you can take funds so if you want to promote any kind of donation funds and if you want to take a payment through paypal like buy me coffee or this you can simply paste the pay me url here and it will generate the link for you click on this next and from here you can select the batch so just imagine that you have got star in your getup profile and you want to showcase so you can select this styling basically i don't like to have the border one so i'll go with the plain background so that is the one i have used in my project uh, sorry in my getup profile and from here you can select different methods so you can select this readme dev quote so you can display different quotes whenever a new user will visit click on this next and from here you can easily able to select and have an overview that how it's going to look so right now i've only selected two program language make sure to select all the languages which you know and that will work fine so i have not provided the enough details make sure to provide it once you provide that that's how it's going to look like and you can simply copy this one and come back to the getup and all you have to do is go back to the repository and once you are into the repository here you can see that i have created a repository with the same name so this is the name of my profile sorry the get a profile name and i have created a repository with the same name 
so make sure to come here and click on this new repository and from here you can give the exact name of your user profile which you have taken here in github and make it public and create this readme file and let's click on this create once you do that it's going to create a repository here just like this and you can see this is the github repository i have and here i have this readme file so simply open this one and all you have to do is click on this edit and now you have to simply copy paste this entire code you will get so simply copy this code and it will give you this entire file so here i have all of this code is will going to give me this and simply paste here and provide the uh, just simply paste here and that will work fine okay if you want to provide an image just like here so this is the way you can add an image in get readme file so you can use this particular exclamation mark then this bracket called alt text and then you can paste the url of the image means your profile and from here you can do the basic adjustment so you can see if you really want to change the alignment so you can do that use this particular keyword called align and provide the location center left right you can add that so here i have pasted all of the things i have used this particular tool to create my get up profile so this is the best and free tool i would say and you have to utilize it you have to make an impressive get up profile because as a developer when you will work on a project or when someone wants to hire you for their project they're going to look at your get up profile that how many projects you have done so if you have a profile just like this it will be easy for them to navigate to see that these are the programming language you know and you can work on that okay so make sure to come and have a look this will not take more than five minutes and i want every single one of you to come and build your get up profile start pushing the code so whatever project you are building no matter whether it's a small or big start pushing to get up because when i was reviewing the portfolio what i have found that many of you have built the project but some very few of you have pushed it to get up and explain about the project that why you have built that what is the architecture you have designed in the project so get up plays a very important role when it's come to getting an internship job and working in an open source project so someone's tried to hire you in an open source contribution how they would know about you if you don't highlight these basic information about yourself so make sure to come and build your portfolio like this the way i have explained it's very very super duper easy to create this kind of thing and it will create a better impression in front of everyone so once you add that make it publish it's going to look like so whenever someone will visit your get a profile they can know more about you hi i'm dollar Hussain, full stack blockchain developer and founder of the blockchain coder i have given the basic information and some important links here you can add multiple images that's very easy if you want to simply design the entire this information in the canva or in any design software and you can import as a as an image you can do that so all you have to do the way we have imported this particular image alt text and provide the link so you can design the entire portfolio using the canva where you can use different graphs you can use different texts and fonts and you can simply place it here so you have both the options but when it's come to defining the stack stack tools sorry text stack make sure to use that one because that will give you a pretty pretty good format but in case of you will go with this particular tool the formatting is not that good okay the formatting is not that good so you can simply copy and you can paste here and you will have the entire data that how it looks and on the base of that you can simply do the modification and change that so again i'm going to provide you this particular link in the description so you guys can click and you can have a complete overview and by the way i have released this pdf for the blockchain developer roadmap many of you have asked me in the last video so i want you to come and have a look so here in the in the resource section once you click on that here you will find the entire roadmap so this is the this is the course which i have launched here is the DeFi roadmap you can simply click and you can download this is the blockchain roadmap this is a javascript and here we have the chat gtp course i want you to come and have a look check this course it's a, an hour something it will give you the basic idea that how chat gtp work and how you can write the uh, ask the right question so i want you to come and have a look click on this DeFi roadmap and it will give you this pdf simply get that and here i have explained every single thing which you have to know about the blockchain roadmap so you can simply come here you can see what are things you have to learn soon the course will be live on our channel where i have explained everything where i will cover every single thing which i have highlighted it here in the DeFi project okay so i want you to come and have a look this will give you a better idea and if you haven't worked i watched this particular video where i have explained every single thing about the development okay so this will give you amazing 
learning when it's come to building a dApp. So I want you to come and have a look at the project that what you will build in this course and uh, look at the modules, look at the chapters we have included, look at the API calls, the method, the Redux context management we are using. It's so powerful. A lot of review, amazing review we have got. So make sure to come and have a look. Everything will make sense. So that's the only thing I want to talk about it because when I was reviewing the portfolio profile, 32 repository. So whatever project I'm building, all of that I'm pushing on GitHub. And some of the projects are private, some of them are public. So some of them are in the contribution. So that's why I'm working on it. So make sure to come and have a look on this particular one. And that will give you amazing idea. And you can simply create your GitHub profile like this for a better user experience. So that's the only thing I will talk about in this video. And if you guys have any idea, any question, any doubt, do let me know in the comment section. Or if you guys have any suggestion for the project, do let me know in the comment section. I'll try to cover that as well. So with that, I'm ending this video. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.